2023 is set to become the year of lab-grown diamonds. First of all, diamonds have never been rare. The reason behind that price tag is simple. Good marketing. Advertising is based on one thing. Happiness. In 1947, the De Beer Diamond Corporation ran a series of advertising campaigns that ranged from paying lecturers to visit local high schools, sending detailed descriptions to all the major newspapers of the diamonds being worn by movie stars. Heck, they even commissioned a series of portraits of engaged socialites wearing diamonds. Their goal, ultimately, was to make diamond engagement rings a societal norm. And I think we can all see for ourselves that they more than succeeded with that. In fact, they admit as much themselves. In their 1948 strategy paper, and I quote, We spread the word of diamonds worn by stars of screen and stage, by wives and daughters of political leaders, by any woman who could make the grocer's wife or the mechanic's sweetheart say, I wish I had what she has. Originally, when it comes to lab-grown diamonds, there was a level of skepticism amongst the public. It gave a sort of off-brand feeling. I mean, certainly, no one would proclaim that their diamond ring was artificial. It wasn't something to be proud of. In fact, I'm sure many women were probably unaware that they had artificial diamond rings. Because their husbands didn't tell them. That's just what I'd expect you to say. He's blissfully unaware of how fake their ring is. But in 2022, the sales of lab-grown diamonds increased by 38%, all the way up to $12 billion. And over 72% of engagement rings sold in 2022, lab-grown. These lab-grown diamonds are way more popular now, in part because they're affordable, but also because people are becoming more and more aware of all the human rights violations that occur in the diamond industry. I think we've all heard the term blood diamonds, after all. So, what do you think about this so-called diamond revolution? Would you choose lab-grown over natural? Let me know your thoughts in the comments below.